Woken up today feeling extra festive and guys 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 let me tell you when i went to bed last night obviously it was halloween yesterday best day ever i loved it so cute so spooky but in the back of my mind it was obviously that it's the first november today and oh my gosh in my little world cheers little bubble the first of november into christmas is here if you disagree with me scrooge get off my channel because for the next what two months just under all you'll be hearing from me is christmas vibes you know you'll be getting them festive feels and i'm gonna put everybody who watches this video in the festive spirit and if you're not then you just you know you're not part of the crew and christmas is the best time of year and i am so glad that it's the first of november i cannot tell you i've been waiting for this day for ages because it now means that i have an excuse to put you know my christmas festivities into play and yes yeah, so today we have a cute little scrunchy moment that's my new little vibes i've got some red ones for christmas i'm not even joking and basically, today, I'm going to bring you with me on a very exciting video. The one that I am so buzzing for. Because this is my first Christmas shop with me of 2019. Drum roll, please. I'll tell you where we're at. We are going to go to Next and Tesco's today, and of course, there's a little Costa in Next. So it would be rude of me, like very, very rude and disrespectful of me, to not go and get a Christmas hot chocolate. You know, to start this video the proper way. So basically, I need to pick things up because otherwise, I could literally talk about Christmas all day. But we need to go get shopping, guys, because I have decorations to get. And basically the plan is I've got three Christmas shop with me videos and then the video after those will be the decoration hauls. So I will show you what I've got in my three little trips. I don't like I don't think I'm end up gonna get up Sorry, the Christmas trees in my mind, you know. Um it's just blocking out my brains like oh ornaments tinsel fairy lights tree toppers everything in my brain right now so i put that to one side but so basically i don't think i'm gonna end up getting that much today it's more gonna be like candles i think because i've already got like a lot of christmas decorations anyway from like last year and before this christmas i've sworn to myself and to my family and friends that it's gonna be the best one and i'm gonna spread so much festive cheer and happiness throughout the next two months whatever it is that i literally want everyone to be elves by the time it comes to christmas day i actually want you to have morphed into an elf because that's what i feel like right now i feel like my ears getting pointier and pointier i'm getting shorter and shorter charlie tells me all the time i think it actually is because i'm turning into an elf he says to me all the time cheer you're so short I'm not even that short, but compared to him, I'm very short. And I go, well, now I'm starting to think, it's because, Charlie, the festive season is coming. And when the festive season comes, <laughs> the elves arrive, you know? like. So, without further ado, we're going to get into next. We're going to go get a hot chocolate cost from Costa. And we're going to live our best lives. And just, you know, get festive. So... Let's go. So we're just walking into next. Look how cute it looks already. See what I mean, guys? Here's you lot telling me it's early. I always get messages on Instagram like you're doing it so early. But next have their Christmas stuff up. There's literally a lady watching me through the window, probably like, what are you doing, hon? But we're just getting in the Christmas spirit, so let's go. Chair. 
guys actually gave me a Christmas cup and I'm so happy. I literally saw them and they probably really embarrassed myself because they were like, why is this bitch going crazy over a Christmas cup? But, you know, and look where we are. Oh my God. I am so excited. How cute. Look at these little glitter ones. I don't even know where to start. I'm a bit, um, overwhelmed. Oh my God, guys. <laughs> I'm very much overwhelmed. Look, how cute is that for a little picture? It's basically cats with hot chocolate down and quickly drink it because I didn't think it through and I can't really carry a big heavy hot chocolate with, you know, all this Christmas stuff to look at. So, this is the first little section. How cute. I got the um, festive spice ones of these, but these look really nice. What are they? Oh no, cinnamon. Right, cute. I've got my um, little bag by the way. Little indoor shopping bag as they call it. I've already got my festive spice pre diffuser. I do need to get the candle, but um, you know, we'll go and get that. Oh my god, look! <gasps> Chai would love that. That is so sweet. The little wooden houses, cute little elves to sit by my door. Oh, they've got more. They're not as nice. How sweet all these. Tea lights. Everything. This is such a vibe. Look at all that. I do want to get all little stuff like this put in the tree, but I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. I think I'm going to. Um, do my tree stuff like next week um but yeah oh festive spice candle guys if you have not smelt this from next festive spice then you are missing out oh i love all this stuff potpourri little vases i like potpourri but i think i want to get a like a scented wreath instead and put it all like in my room and stuff but um Hey, look at all this stuff guys that that's the one that i've got festive spice free diffuser that's really cute and i think that potpourri is festive spice scented as well which is cute and look at all this oh it's the penguin i just feel very overwhelmed you know what i mean so many cute little decorations here that go with my theme oh they're quite cute because i am doing like a tartan thing they're really sweet. Look, I thought this would be a quite little cute idea to get like um, decorations for our initials on. They have got these ones, which I think personally are prettier, but these go more with my tree because my tree is going to be like red, green, and gold. Um, and how cute is this? Look, it's a little Christmas jumper decoration. I love that. So sweet. A little hot chocolate kit, festive spice wax candles. <gasps> Santa stocking, love that. I literally love their Christmas bedding in here, it's so sweet. 24 seats until Christmas, hun. We wish. Oh, I absolutely love all this. Guys, where do I actually start? <laughs> that wreath is really cute, and that one. I've got light. What's our present topper set if you want to put these with, on top of your gear? I think my tree is pre-lit. I can't actually remember. I probably should sort that out. But I'm sure that my tree is pre-lit so I don't need to get any more lights. But, you know, we'll see. We'll see. Garlands and that I want to look at um, in B&M because I think they'll be better for garlands. But, I mean, if they're not, we can always come back to next. We already know. If you already watched my videos, you know I'm obsessed with the smell of gingerbread. Um, and I've already got like so many gingerbread candles, so I don't need any more. What's this? Is there another little festive spice candle? Is that the same? Oh my god, it's the same scent but a different thing. But I think I actually prefer like the classic red um, candle pots. Do I get potpourri? Like, do I? I don't know what I do with it. I need to work it all out really. 
guys, this is an absolute vibe. We've got Diamante, Staghead, if anyone's into that. I'm sure there's someone on my channel. But is that potpourri as well? Can anyone tell me what you actually do with potpourri? I've seen um, El Darby, because I watch her videos. I've seen her put it in like a vase, but I don't know what I'd do with it. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe in my bathroom? I'm not really sure. Because if I get it, I might as well get the big bag, you know? That's six pounds, and for this big bag, it is 12 pounds, so you get definitely more than double. I'm not sure, guys. I'm really, really not sure. Help. It does smell unreal, I can't lie to you. But I just don't know what I'd do with it. I might have a look on Pinterest and see what people do with their potpourri. Um, because I think that'd be a good little idea. You can always find, if you're ever stuck for like de decorations and stuff and ideas, go on to Pinterest because it's so good. Like really, really good. But they even have a festive spice one that's like with three wicks in it. Is it wicks they're called? The little stick things. So I know it's not Christmas themed, but how cute is all this stuff? Like the pink. Love that. My mum would like that. So sweet. I love those like pink and gold cushions. They're really cute. Oh, these little penguins. They just don't go. I saw this on the website, but they just really don't go. And same with like these little ball balls. They just don't go with my theme. Maybe next year we'll do a pink tree. What do you guys think? There's me. One thing that I did really need to get is wrapping paper. And um, basically, I mean, obviously you've already heard me, but I'm doing a tartan theme, so I thought that would be really nice. Just like as sort of classic ones. I really found um, wrapping paper that I want to use for Charlie's presents, but I thought this is just cute for like friends and family. Look, deck the halls, blah, 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 blah. Little gnome down there. I love all this stuff so much guys. I'm absolutely buzzing for Christmas now. Look, Snow and Charlie are our little black Robin little things. Santa. I just feel so happy. So so happy. These are actually free too, these wrapping papers. And you want a good bargain on wrapping paper, you know where to come. I feel like I need to get a few more tree bits. I did think maybe have these on the tree because they're really cute. Just that little Santa jacket, it's so really sweet. They have all their Christmas cards in and all the wrapping stuff, which is really sweet. Love all those. And they've got more wrapping paper here. I think I do like my tartan one, although that's quite nice. That's really nice. What do you prefer out of those? any of you guys work in an office you could have this little office tree just put in your desk how cute is that does it smell no it's a plastic tree only i would pick that up oh they had tree skirts over here actually but there's none that i like there's none that are calling my name they've only got this gray one and the glitter one and then this little, i was saying that that's really nice i wanted like a big thick red one so i might just wait until um like B&M or somewhere like that because they must have like a nicer tree skirt so sorry Nick, the tree skirts are not bad this year I can't actually see anything else that I like I'm not going to show you what I'm going to get because like I said it's going to be all in my video but um yeah I'm going to I'm going to test guys now and go and look and see if their decorations are which fingers crossed they are if not we'll just be in the Christmas chocolate section for about an hour look all the Christmas cards Hamper kits, more cards, wrapping paper, everything that you need, you know. How cute is that little bag? They've got all their like Christmas gift stuff. I don't see any like decorations. I've been to one Tesco that's already got their stuff, but I don't think um, this one has. Guys, so far I am very disappointed in Tesco's. They normally have my back this time of year, but 
Maybe they're just being a bit slow. I've seen so much Christmas stuff in the Tesco's I went to the other day and they have none of it. Like, they have their Christmas chocolate and stuff which is cute but that's not what we're here for. At all. I'm very, very disappointed. Tesco, you've let me down. I was going in there expecting there to be more stuff. Basically, basically, basically. So, before you get confused, the other day I went into Tesco with Charlie, the one near to him. Same size, this one's probably actually bigger, to be honest with you. And they had all Christmas kitchenware bowls, cake tins I actually wanted to get but I was like no let me wait to do it in my video no none of that in the Tesco near me considering I am obsessed with Christmas and so and Charlie loves Christmas but not to the level that I do so why should he get all the good, like, why should his Tesco's get all the Christmas stuff in and not mine because obviously I know mine will but guys it's, it's just not you know it's just it doesn't sit well with me I just feel a bit let down and I know it's only the first of November but I just I think I had too high expectations I think that's what it was because obviously what I saw in Charlie's Cisco I thought oh mine are gonna have that and obviously it's gonna be a bit nearer so they have more but no uh, feel let down but you know what we're not gonna let it ruin the vibe next I star for you Tesco's you get a C from me today because you had some stuff but nowhere near to what you would do this time of year and what to the other Tesco had considering that was a week ago what's the excuse I bet you any money though tomorrow it'll be all be in after I film this video but don't you worry guys, we will be going back to Tesco's when they buck their ideas up because I feel very let down and but what can we do? But it doesn't matter because next, thank you for being my saviour and kind of wish I went to Tesco's first now but I thought Tesco's might have more stuff than next. But natural in fact, they only had Christmas food and Christmas gift sets. But it's okay. Because it is only the 1st of November, so I do need to chill out a little bit. But you know when you just get something in your head, like, oh, what's going to be all this? It's going to be tinsel. Like the other Tesco's had cake tins that I really love, like all Christmas trees on them. And Tesco's, my Tesco's had all that. They don't even have the stuff that the other one had. None of it. So unfortunately guys, it wasn't a bad trip, but it wasn't the best. But um, it's okay because we will, we will give you another chance to go in a couple weeks. I will give you another chance and if you don't, you know, do well then, then unfortunately you're going to be taking off the Christmas shopping list. Thank you. And, but anyway, so... I'm actually very happy with what I got in next. The one thing that I did go in there basically to definitely get was the Festive Spice Candle. Because they have the Reed Diffuser but there's nothing like a nice cosy warm candle. And yeah, so, um, next, great. Tesco's, not so great. And I am very happy with the fact that it's the 1st of November. We're just going to blank out the whole Tesco experience because I feel like they do deserve another chance because I do love Tesco's, I must admit. Out of all the supermarkets, Tesco's is and has always been my favourite. I even prefer Tesco's to Marks, Spencer, Marks and Spencer's. Although we will need to do a Marks trip because if you have never had Marks and Spencer's Christmas biscuit tins, get to know. Get to know the m and Christmas selection box you know and um, I don't actually think they're like Christmas exclusive I think they're actually all year round but they don't show them off enough 
as much as I do at Christmas. And meanwhile, I'm so excited to have a cup of tea and our M&S biscuit selection box that we have every single, like, this time of year. And, um, yeah. But, basically, guys, let's not be down. Let's be festive because it is the 1st of November, which means that December is in four weeks time i think i might actually be five but it doesn't matter because in my head it's only four weeks actually guys one thing that i did get in next that i feel like I, i'm not going to show you the rest of it but i can show you this thing because we can use it now give me one sec car air fresheners Let's choose what we're gonna have. Cause my point saving these to the haul because I've already got some of these put away. So let's just put these in the car. Why not? That's what they're for, so that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, guys, they're so cute. These were, oh my God, this was so nice. Three pound fifty for three. You get Ronnie the Reindeer, Sid the Snowman and Penny the penguin and they all smell like cinnamon so cute i might go back and get another pack because i forgot i needed to get some for best friend courtney because i did sad pick her some of these up as well but me being me i forgot so sorry courtney i'll go back and get yours but how cute we have ronnie we have sid and we have penny and we have cheetah we could be in a band Christmas band. So what one should I put up? They all smell the same. I feel like Ronnie the Reindeer I should save for nearer Christmas. So it's between Penny and Sid. Hmm. Sid smells stronger so maybe he'll last longer so maybe I should put Penny up. Come on Penny. Let's do it for the girls. Don't let me down here hun. So good. It's pure cinnamon that. Let's put it up. Hi guys, it's me. Penny, you just look fabulous, hon. You look so cute and I love you. So guys, I'm actually going to end the video here. I really hope that you enjoyed it. I don't know why I just did that. But I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that you feel very slightly festive because it's the best time of year and we should all be really, really happy. And not even, I know it's cringe, but not even for like materialistic stuff. Like this time of year, I think, brings everyone together. And this time of year can be hard for, like, for some people um, for whatever reason. But that's why we all have to stick together and just, yeah, like, if you can't come together in the rest of the year use, a cynic, use Christmas as an excuse to so bring everyone together have a hot chocolate with one another give each other a Christmas hug because that's what we do I'll give you a hug from me to you my, my, my little rhyme there but yeah in all seriousness this time of year is so special it's like I said it's hard for some people for um, like their personal reasons but we should all stick together and all just have fun and love each other because that's what Christmas is, you know, that's what it does. It brings people together and I love that about Christmas. That's why I think it makes me so happy. Um, and yeah. So I'm going to skedaddle back home because I need to go. What are you even doing today? Oh, today I've got, actually got a very busy day. So I need to go home, have a quick cup of tea and a bit of toast. I need to edit this video because this is Friday today and it's going to be going up Sunday but the whole weekend I'm very very busy today I've got a spray tan later um because I'm very pal tans to glow on Instagram best spray tans in the world and um and yeah I need to do some singing today um just some singing practice and stuff like that and I've also got some work to do so I best go and get on with that it is 10 past 10 or 8 past 10 to be precise on a Friday morning I'm going to go, I'm going to love you, I'm going to leave you have a lovely Sunday evening with lots of cuddles and nice little films we've got other celebrities soon so get ready for that 
and yeah so i really hope you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up uh, please subscribe if you want to see more because i'd really really appreciate it and yeah i love you all so much all my little like socials and everything down below and yeah so please 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 <laughs> give this video a thumbs up if you're excited for christmas if you are excited to put your tree up to go ice skating to go christmas food shopping give it a thumbs up because i am too and i'm so excited i love you all and thank you so much for watching sorry that i babble on but when someone says the word christmas me i just don't stop i'll be straight with you i don't stop and i'm gonna go now because i need to go on my work but i love you all so much and thank you so much for watching see you in my next video Mwah.